Hey, come on, man. You're not cut out for this. Can't you just make Lauren work more hours? I told her she should quit. What? That's why I'm here working my ass off? You have a beautiful wife that I'll have sex with you and bring home money and you want to throw that away? You stupid, stupid man. Hey. Wow, you look amazing. Thanks. I brought you this from the beach. What did you bring me? Nothing. Wait, why aren't you at work? It's a long story, but I just thought a lot about what you said, and the bottom line is I decided to quit my job. Oh, come on! I mean, you're, you're still okay with that, right? Yeah, sure, right. I mean, I didn't think it'd be today, but, you know, today is now, and tomorrow's another day, but today is good. Good, because I realized, you know, maybe I'm working just to work, you know? I mean, I'm not getting that much out of it anymore, besides the faculty trip to the San Diego Zoo, so just gonna see what life feels like without it. As a guy who works sporadically, you don't wanna do this. <laughs> wow, you know, I never get to see you in action all hot and sweaty. Pick up something heavy. Now, but I've laminated and everything. <clears throat> oh, are you okay? I mean, maybe, maybe you should, Cool, uh, cool, uh, watch your feet. Oh. <sighs> well, you're cute and smart. I'm gonna get going. Maybe there'll be a homemade pie waiting for you. Or not. Gotta walk for a run. But first I gotta get back to the beach. Ugh, bye. You happy? You got what you wanted, Mr. Soul Provider. Now the weight of the world's on your shoulders. You can't even carry a bag of manure. Damn it. Now I have to go home after a long day's work and eat pie.